Hello everyone. So today we are going to talk about another important function for JavaScript array. It's called sum. This method will work on every element of the array and will return you true or false based on whether at least one element passes the condition that you mentioned. So let's see an example. So let me create an array of numbers where I have few numbers like 10, 100, 23, 45, 90, that's all. So what I'm trying to find out if in this array there is at least one element which is greater than 50. So what I can do, I can use the I can use a sum method and this method will this method will need a callback function where this is the first one the single number and this will single number is greater than equals to 50. So now what is telling it will uh, you I'm using the sum function on the array numbers and this will return the sum function will return true if there is at least one element in the numbers array which is greater than 50 and we know that we have two elements like 190 so definitely i'm expecting this console.log will give me true so let's go and execute i am getting true now let's say Let's change a little bit and let's try to figure it out if there is at least one element which is greater than 150. So definitely there is no element in this array which is greater than 150. So this time if I execute this console.log, I am expecting false. So let me go ahead and execute. Exactly, I received false. So this is the way how you can use a sum method to find out whether there is at least one element which satisfies the condition that you mentioned. I hope you like this video and I'll see you in the next one. Till then, bye-bye.